this is your librarian, Adriana. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the library catalog. We've had a few changes in the past semester, so I just want to make sure everyone's up to date. So I'm going to do a search um, for a topic, um, just pulling one out of the air here. Um, if you hear coughing in the background, that's my 10 year old. We're good. Um, all right, so I'm going to use the keyword search phrase police brutality. And that's a pretty, pretty big broad search, but I just want to show you what a standard search looks like in our catalog. Um, you'll notice the drop down menu on the right side here offers us a few options. You'll want to use you search catalog. Um, otherwise, it will search the entire library website. And this will give you access to both our physical and electronic resources or sources. Um, notice in this search, I can see online ebooks. Um, I'll also find um, multiple versions of texts. Uh, print books, videos, and if you use the drop-down menus here in the right margin, uh, this is a little refinement menu that will help you to get the kinds of sources that you are interested in. Uh, for example, newspaper articles versus other types of articles, dissertations, uh, book chapters, conference proceedings, etc. The location here um, is in reference to databases rather than physical locations. And even though we are physically um, closed for the time being, if you find a print item, say a book, that you would like to check out that is not available online, I'm going to look for one. What's a print book? This one here. Um, what you can do is take the, <coughs> pardon the coughing, you can take the uh, title information, author information, and the year of publication, and if you go back to the library's main page, right at the top here, you will find that you can actually, um, check out physical items from the collection even though we are currently closed. If you are student, staff, or faculty, all you have to do is email us here with the title, author, and year of publication, and physical requests are sent out every Friday. So that's it. That's just a super quick video um, with a little bit of coughing in the background to um, keep you up to date on how our library catalog works. If you have any questions, please, please feel free to reach out to me via email at adriana.parker at utah.edu. Thanks for your patience with my limited technology know-how.